Well, hello there, YouTube, and good morning. It is the 18th of October, and you would not believe the storms we had last night. In fact, until just about an hour or so ago, it was just pounding out here. It's just a, a light drizzle now at the moment. Well, Mama, we uh, survived our first crazy storm bout. Yeah. <laughs> on the back end of 2017. There's probably a, a lot less fall leaves in the trees no than what there was. That's a crazy week. Man, and then coming home last night, it was like a war zone. It's like we passed this wall, we left woodland. And then poof. Yeah, about Kalama, you could hear it and feel it hitting the truck and stuff. I'll tell you one thing, the truck handles the wind a whole lot better than that element did. <laughs> That element was like driving a train boxcar down the road. Yeah. He'd change lanes in that thing. Yeah. <laughs> look at this. Just from yesterday. Look how much nicer it looks in here. More fallish. Isn't that amazing? I'm telling you, it's a, it's a daily thing. You know, it looks less of a war zone down this little section of highway this morning than it did coming home last night like chunks of tree limbs laying everywhere. It was kind of nuts. Check this out. This guy had one of those little portable garage things back there. Hope he didn't have a lot of stuff in it. That, that thing got down. blown over. That's like that one that we have on the side. We just finally, it's sitting in a position that the wind catches it. And those tops are not cheap. You know, you have stuff in there. I mean, they're great. But man, they do not handle wind for very long. And that wind comes across there like crazy. Rips some things apart. Hasn't lifted it up off the ground. Whoever put that thing there prior to us purchasing the house, that thing must be anchored down into China or something. It doesn't come off the ground, but it'll sure take the tarp off of it. Look at the pretty colors up on Carol's Bluff. That looks cool looking out over the Columbia out there too. Man, it's weird how the fall colors are just really kicking in all of a sudden. Man, it's really getting gorgeous coming through here. everything up for the snow show this weekend yeah. and that's why poor Kelly's got to work this weekend bless her heart I think it's gonna be another wet day I just just my guess <laughs> yeah. all right mama I'm head on down all right <laughs> I can't believe we got one of these 2014 CB 1100s brand new in the crate you guys remember a few videos back? It was sitting over there. It still hasn't been washed. And the crate so long it got dirty in the crate. How weird is that? What? Nine grand? That's pretty cheap for a phenomenal motorcycle. You guys remember I rode that red 2013? I was actually interested in buying it. Then he came out with the 14 model, the six speed and all kinds of cool stuff. What's wild is when you ride this thing, if you close your eyes, it sounds and feels just like my old 83 CB1100F. But man, you grab that throttle and it's a whole lot different. <laughs> all that fancy new high-tech motor with fuel injection. It's air oil cooled. It's got all that high-tech stuff like Harleys and Indians do if it starts to get hot it starts you know skipping sparks and doing different injection things it's really cool so here's a color correct a little video clip of that blue I noticed that hero freaked out over this thing blued out everything everything in the background was blue 
I'm going, um, that didn't show that as cool as it really looks. So here's a second look. The bronze one is gone. Jeez, there was five of them sitting here yesterday. Amazing all this nasty weather. The Indians still sell out of here. The kid of mine is one tire changing fool. I'm gonna head up and get me a cup of java. Go tackle the rain. It's just been literally the same all day. Just a steady drizzling keep everything wet rain. <laughs> She's still just a drizzling out there. I got a test ride in one of these things. The owner's son took that black one for a spin yesterday. And he said, that thing was crazy fun. He goes, Smoke, you gotta ride that thing. Way cool. The mileage on it. $9.99. That thing's like brand new. She ain't even broke in. I don't think we're going to get a break in the weather. <laughs> I know we're not. I just pointing out them pretty trees out there. It's only 4 o'clock and it's dark enough the lights are out. But uh, parts manager told Kelly she could go ahead and bail out if she wants. So, uh, we're leaving at four o'clock. How do you like that? And you know what? I think I left my watch in here. Heading back. <laughs> oh man, I'd have been mad. My phone, the fob for the truck, and my watch are sitting there. I had it covered up because I was blowing stuff around. I didn't want to get dust all over everything. Oh, I'd have been mad. Oh, the pleasing rides. Of the wet weather in the Pacific Northwest. Flat making up for lost rain <laughs> last night and today. Holy moly. But the fall colors are still pretty. You can't take away the pretty. <laughs> right? Right. I love the clouds in the mountains. I don't know if you can see that, but the clouds are kind of floating along through the trees there. That's so beautiful. Man, look at that squall line right there. That's crazy. It's almost pitch black dark out here at 11 minutes to 5. That's a scary looking one. That one's probably going to unleash some, some craziness on it, on us, I would imagine. The little woman put gas in the car. <laughs> and then she didn't know any better. Cause, and put super in it. Yeah. But the price went down. It was three hundred nine ninety nine. Now it's two ninety nine. But we paid three nineteen ninety nine because it's got a full tank of super. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It'll like it. She goes. Oh, I thought you put super in everything. I said, well, yeah. This only needs regular. But you guys remember right after we got this thing, within weeks or so, it was right after discovering the the two rock dings in the back. I ran into Mike. He's a truck driver from yeah. Missouri. Anyway, I met him and his lovely wife. He comes walking up and I look at him and he looks at me and he goes, hey. And I go, hey, he goes, you don't remember me, do you? And I'm going, oh my God, he's so familiar. He goes, I'm Mike from Missouri. I go, wow. As soon yeah. as he said Mike, I recognized who he was. But anyway, I was in there talking to him at the, at the little boy's room. And I, I'm thinking, Kelly's going to be wondering what in the heck am I doing? You were taking quite a while. She goes, maybe I had a heart attack or something. I need to, do I need to send somebody in there? So she peeked in and seen me talking. And anyway, that was great meeting you guys today. That was awesome. That's way and, cool. And the little woman put gas in. What did you think when you opened up the cap and there was no uh, gas yeah, cap to unscrew? I went to reach the, oh, I guess it doesn't take a gas cap. You just <laughs> shoved the old nozzle in the hole. Yep. Kind of crazy, huh? It is. First time yeah. I put gas in it. Yeah, first time. All right. It's not raining at the moment. And we're going to roll on towards the house. Look. She's got windows all the way around in the truck. Yeah. I guess uh, that was a necessity. Yeah, Northwest, <laughs> you best. That, she's going to be sitting in some wet seats. Ooh, look at those cool tractory things. Oh, yeah. Well, all camouflaged. All right, let's roll.
Oh, and she goes, and I got the gas in before the guy started pumping it and stirring up all the crap off the bottom of the tank. I was trying to make it hurry. Hurry! <laughs> all right. Oh, yeah, look. The rain has stopped just enough. I can show you some fall colors. It'll drive you nuts talking about colors. Oh, we'll be talking about lighting tonight. Other than maybe the lack thereof. Ooh, we gotta see if we can get show them the red trees oh, off to the right here. Yeah. Let me let me get prepared for that. Okay, Cameron, you gotta focus now. These trees are so beautiful, just brilliantly red. The wind didn't blow them. Oh, the wind blew most of it out, but it's still oh, there. Yeah. Oh yeah. We gotta show you the barn with some fall colored trees in the background. <laughs> you guys probably have this Dr. Pierce's barn thing like etched in your head. I think so. And that pretty, there she is in the fall. So who comes along and picks up all the limbs that fell out in the road? I don't know. Yeah, it looked like a tornado brushed through here. Just a little bit more. I promise this will be all. Take these last couple of turns. You gotta, you gotta see it while you can because the rain's gonna wash it all away. Oh, look at the layers of the different levels. Yeah where they're changing there. You remember this little bush here? I'm showing you guys how it's starting to turn. Look at her now. Oh yeah. Beautiful. Yep. There's some cars passing by when we stopped. We come pulling in. The girls didn't come out so the the traffic going by disguised the sound of the vehicle or something. They figured it out. <laughs> Crazy old Abby. Where is Madison? Look at Abby. Look, look at to Abby. see where she is. She's all perked up like Rin Madison's Tin Tin. Like There's there. Madison. It's gonna come through. Careful. Abby, your sister done left you, mutt. Where's Abby? She don't even know she left. I don't think so. <laughs> she didn't even know. Oh, there. Now she figured it out. Abby? Come on. Don't want her to run underneath a wheel or something. No, she's looking for it, but she's already ran I up know. and went in there. <laughs> Look at her. She's like, oh, where, where'd my sister go? So, Anne, why is she all dusty? Anne ended up with the uh, red collar, and Sasha ended up with the pink. <laughs> Come on, guys. <laughs> Didn't they get confused as to who mom is? I know. I think they run up to Abby and go, oh, wait, you're not mom. And Anne loves Abby, so she chases her around. Look at Sasha. She goes, hi. Hi, Aunt. Aunt Abby. You know, they're fish. She's officially done. They they tried to get something from her, but it's short lived. <laughs> Meatheads. Well, hello there, YouTube. <laughs> we probably sounded like we're a little out of breath. We uh, uh, Leo got tangled and got him undone. All the girls went inside, and we go back out to get the puppies. Puppies are gone. They were like a fourth of the way down the road there. Little marmots, just, you gotta hold on to them. Yep, just off on an adventure. So I'd run down there and grab them, those couple little knuckleheads. <laughs> they're so cute. Then you're carrying them and they're just loving and kissing and nibbling at your ears and everything. They're so glad to see you. I know it. They're so They're sweet. so adorable. But uh, anyway, it was a very wet day. As you can see, we're standing outside, even though it's really cloudy and it's out there. It's a break. It's a break. It's not raining. So uh, that's very nice. It's gonna be wet for a bit. So yeah. any uh, any nice weather, we'll let you know in a hurry. You'll yes. <laughs> you'll see me on a motorcycle. 
I was even going to test ride one of those KTM 390s today, but it literally never stopped. Yeah, it's I'm not going to go out there and get. Day. Yeah, I'm not going to get soaked riding one of those things. But uh, anyway, I hope the weather's nice, or if it's not nice, I hope you're staying dry or warm or cool or whatever However the case may, it may be. be. <laughs> Wherever you're at in the on this globe we all share together. But uh, anyway, we're going to call it a day. Alrighty, thank you guys so very, very much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And you guys have a wonderful Friday or Saturday. Heck yeah, quick and easy. Didn't make nobody even had a chance to go to sleep on that one. I know it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow's Friday. Unfortunately, Kelly has to work through the weekend, so it'll just be. Oh, I don't know what I'll do. We'll come up with something. Yeah. But it looks like it's going to rain. It's I'll little... put him to work on projects. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The good old honeydews. Yeah, the projects. <laughs> All right. All Until right. tomorrow. Okay. Hopefully tomorrow will be more lively. It's been a very quiet two days. Yeah, it has. Yeah. Oh, well. It's nice for a change. Yeah. All right. See you guys tomorrow. Thank you very much. Bye-bye <laughs> now.